All right, Teenage Rip, since this is a flashback we just do all the time now, why'd you end up killing that boy? What do you say about Beth? He's, he said, he said. Was it something sexual? Yes, sir. Rip, that should have only upset you if you were fucking my daughter or something. Are you fucking my daughter? And now would be a good time to lie, Rip. Well, sir, you told me to never to lie to you. So yeah, we did reverse cowgirl one time and then she actually made me watch her have sex with another cowboy, that cowboy that I killed. And I'm pretty sure she was just doing regular cowgirl because it was in the back of a Jeep. What the fuck is wrong with my daughter? Anyways, Rip, if you accept this brand, this ranch is gonna be your home as long as there's a ranch. As long as I don't have some spineless rat adopted son try to destroy everything I've worked so hard for. God, it makes me mad just thinking about that possibility. Well, the future couldn't be much worse then. Lloyd, not now. Howdy, y'all. It's good to have a girl that loves me for who I am and not just because I won the rodeo that one time. Weird looking guys can get hot country girls as long as they're real cowboys. Thanks for all the nice things you said to me the other day, Mr. Dutton. Monica, when I said everything was your fault, I meant it from the bottom of my heart. Everyone, I'm giving a speech that I prepared with Burnett Beth to impeach my daddy. The governor, my daddy, doesn't care about me or Montana. He just wants to protect his ranch. Mr. Dutton, what are you doing here? They're trying to build a pipeline through your land, and I ain't gonna let that happen. So you do admit it's our land? No. Governor Dunn, we have a problem. Look at my phone. Senate tribunal seeking impeachment. God damn it, Jamie! What are you doing still home, you disgusting hippie? Don't drink my vodka, and don't eat my M&Ms! I drink kombucha, I have a peanut allergy, and stop with your internalized misogyny. Jamie just got your dad impeached. I'm gonna fuck Jamie until he dies! What? It's a figure of speech. I'm not sure that it is. Y'all better bring your warm clothes. It's gonna be cold in Texas. Yay! I heard it's so cold you could use the hair in your gooch to brush your dead tooth. Use your what to brush your what? You gonna miss Teeter there, Colby? I am a prisoner of not only this ranch, but Teeter's unconventional style of communication of her affection. You wasn't throwing a convention after I farted on your toothbrush. I knew you did something to my toothbrush. Boing! I love you, Colby. Burnett Beth, tell me how good I am for portraying my family, but just maybe don't fart this time. You did so good, and I didn't fart, that was the couch. Not a business, that is self-mutilation. <laughs> my couch has never made that noise before. Oh no, original Beth is here! Jamie, you resign, or I'm gonna send evidence of you murdering your dad to the sheriff! You won't do that, because that'll expose all the people your dad's killed at the train station. That's right, Jamie. Stand up for yourself makes me so fucking hot. <laughs> Daddy, Jamie betrayed us after all the love and affection we've shared with him after the years. Beth, I know, and we didn't do any of those things. We have no other option than to kill Jamie. Beth, come here. Let's talk while the camera pans out so no one really knows if I'm agreeing with you or thinking of another plan. Burnett Beth, original Beth's gonna try and kill me now. She wouldn't do that, Jamie. You don't understand, Burnett Beth. She used to stab me in the leg with a fork at the dinner table just for fun. Don't worry, Jamie. I'll take care of this.